In H-Town, of course, we are talking about the rodeo. Yes, indeed. Festivities start today with the World's Championship Barbecue Contest out at NRG Park. Our rodeo expert, the Kathy Hernandez, live at the fabulous Cotton Club to fill us in on what's going on. Hey, Kathy. Fabulous is an understatement. Take a look right behind me. You, you don't even feel like you're at the Houston Rodeo Cook-Off anymore. They call it Champagne Cowboy. This is the Cotton Club. They are the title sponsors of the entire Rodeo Cook-Off. Everyone here is hard at work. Their cookers say they look forward to this weekend all year round. The competition's fun and, you know, live music, good times, good people. I mean, what's not to love? At the Rodeo Houston Cook-Off, well, it's about more than just the barbecue. Over at 300 Justice Road Cookers, they're starting early with ribs, sausage, and even a whole hog on the grill. It's the biggest event that goes on in Houston, and there's just, it's just so special. There's so much camaraderie around here. On Saturday, they even have an extra special day to honor their longtime friend, Navy SEAL Commander Brian Boudreaux. He died last year after a training accident. And we try to bring together all the things he loved about life and remember him. Down the road, it's an experience like no other at the Cotton Club, this year's title sponsor. This is our um, our definition of bringing caviar cowboy to Texas. You can be a cowboy and still have that elevated experience with our red roses, with the derby vibe, with the chandeliers and the drapes. 500 people a night will pack the Cotton Club for food, drinks, and music. Welcome to the Gold Pony. In the back is an extra fabulous area, a VIP lounge they call the Golden Pony. That's where you can just hang out, kick your boots off, and just have a different laid back experience. You got the fabulous environment inside, and guess what? You got the fabulous food right here. Chef Wade, tell us what you're doing here. How's everybody doing today? Oh, for um, so I have a little bit of RC Ranch Wagyu beef that we're going to be having this evening, and um, just a little fresh lobster and shrimp. So we're going to do a little surf and turf for you real quick. Let's do it. Okay, so Let's do quick, it. I yes. Much time. I got a little bit of uh, Mater D butter, a little Wagyu tallow that we're going to throw on top of here to sear. Then we're gonna take our shrimp and toss them in there. We'll leave that one for a little later. We've got some nice little lobster claws. We're gonna let that saute. We're gonna hit it with a little lemon juice, just like Ooh, that. Looking and good, little, smelling good I too. A little tool over here. We gotta give a little, a little loving. And once that goes and sautes a little bit, then we're gonna hit it with the Tequila. Oh, some tequila. I'm gonna bring that down for a simmer and enjoy. There you go. How long does that take to cook? Oh, that's gonna take about two minutes. Two and that's minutes. it. Yes, ma'am. Thank ma you so much. What do you look forward to here at the rodeo? Oh, cook just off. enjoying all the folks coming in and cooking great food for everybody. It already smells delicious, y'all. I think I'm gonna stick to the Wagyu here. Y'all are not gonna be getting some today. <laughs> I'm gonna finish it all out yeah. here. But guess what? Again, the most exciting time in mm -hmm. Houston is here. Happy rodeo season. Happy it's rodeo nice season. To, to say it, and it's nice to be out here and, and smell it all. I know, and, and, and to talk about and have tequila before noon know, on a I Thursday, Kathy. Yes. He'll, he'll join you in the beef <laughs> tasting. I'll take the tequila. That's how we're gonna work it out.